Hi, we are Hatteras Technologies, and we would like to demonstrate the Xenon Lamp Module Replacements in the Alcon Acuras High Brightness Illuminator. Here is the Acuras High Brightness Illuminator, operating with the lamp ignited. You can see the indicator here is showing green. That means that the lamp's age is still below the recommended max of 400 hours. You can check its age by pressing this button with an exclamation mark, and it shows 5 hours as the age of the lamp. Right now, it is showing the percentage of attenuation on both channels. If you press this button, you can see the intensity of each channel in lumens. The first thing to do before replacing a lamp is to switch off the lamp and the system. So we're switching off the lamp, then we will go ahead and turn it around. and we're switching the system off here with the switch. Then we just unplug it from the power output as the Alcon manual recommends. So now it's unplugged, and I actually go ahead and unplug it from the system as well to be completely confident that the system is off. So right now, because the lamp was operating, it is hot. The manual recommends waiting for 5 minutes before going inside and retrieving the lamp module. So I'll stop the video at this point, and in the next part of the video, we will go further. So the system is cooled for 5 minutes. It's ready to go. And the tools that you will need to remove the lamp module are an M4 metric Allen wrench, shatterproof plastic goggles to protect your eyes, and gloves. We start with unscrewing these two thumb screws holding the cover of the lamp compartment. You can use a flat tip screwdriver if they are tight. And there's the lamp module there. You'll need to unscrew the holding screw, the screw that holds it on the dowel pins. Okay, now you need to move the screw into the hole on the left and start screwing it in. As you screw it in, the screw will be pushing the lamp off the dowel pins, and eventually you will see the lamp module sliding over the rails. Now is the point where it starts sliding, moving towards us. And this releases the lamp from the dowel pins. Now it's freely moving on the rails. So at this point, there are two things that you can do with this lamp module. You can throw it in the trash and buy a new lamp module from Alcon, or you can send it to us, Hatteras Technologies. We will refurbish the central element here, which is the Ceramax Xenon lamp with a brand new identical lamp. We buy it from the same manufacturer, an identical lamp as they use, and then we use a sophisticated laser alignment fixture to align the lamp module to specs that are better than any other currently on the market. So save money and refurbish rather than trash it. Okay, once you get the new lamp module in your hands, here's how you reinstall it. You need to move this holding screw back into holding position from the lamp retraction position. There. There's a trick to how the lamp slides in. Inside the system, there's a thermistor arm, looking like this, but much smaller. And what happens when you slide the lamp module in is that the tip of the thermistor starts pushing against the edge of the lamp. As you press the lamp in, this tip goes over here and starts measuring the temperature of the lamp's heat sink. So there's a little bit of resistance as you push the lamp in. There's a soft click at the end. 
there. And once it is clicked in, then you can start tightening the holding screw. This brings the lamp into working position and holds it there. So now we just reinstall the cover for the lamp compartment. The cover has this rod that, hold, that goes into this hole. It is an interlock mechanism and this is how it operates. And we're done. The new lamp is installed and the system is ready to be operated. Just connect the power cord and plug it in. Please visit our website. There's also a link in it below this video. There you can look into the new option of refurbishing the lamp module rather than trashing it. Be green, save money, and save Mother Earth too. Thank you for viewing this video. We hope you have found it helpful.